All right, 604 here, a major story here in our area. Six years and two trials later, the jury found Emmanuel Lopes guilty. He now faces life in prison for killing a Weymouth police sergeant and an innocent bystander. Take a look at what led up to yesterday's verdict. The deadly shooting happened in July of 2018. Now, Lopes's first prosecution ended in a mistrial in July of last year. That's when a jury couldn't get on the same page. But a second trial with jurors from a different county began last month. And then after more than a week of deliberation, the jury arrived at that guilty verdict. NBC 10's Mary Marcos is live this morning outside the courthouse in Denham. Mary, I know so much emotion still must be ringing true this morning. Absolutely, Lauren. This is a very emotional time for everyone. But with this guilty verdict, the victims' families can finally breathe a sigh of relief. It was the happiest day of my life. Those are two. What's Michael Chesna's family finally getting closure after a jury found Emmanuel Lopes guilty in the Weymouth police sergeant's murder, along with 77-year-old Vera Adams. Both were shot and killed in July of 2018. Lopes now faces life in prison. His first prosecution ended in a mistrial in July of last year when a jury could not decide whether Lopes should be convicted due to his history of mental illness. A second trial with a jury from a different County began last month. After more than a week of deliberation, that new jury found him guilty. The victim's loved ones sharing their reactions outside the Dedham courthouse yesterday. I'm going to tell them that their father got the justice that they deserved. finally deserved, and right. Vera did too. You never give up. You know, be positive, help people, do things for people. You know, and that's what we're going to do. That's what my son did. Now, Lopes will be sentenced on March 19th, and he could face life in prison without parole. Live in debt, Mary Marcos, NBC10 Boston.